Hey friends, today I want to share with you from 1 John chapter 3, verses 16 through 20. And this is what the Apostle John says. He says, this is how we know what love is. How do we know what love is? This is how we know what love is. Jesus Christ laid down his life for us, and we ought to lay down our lives for our brothers. If anyone has material possessions and sees his brother in need, but has no pity of him, on him, how can the love of God be in him? This is just like what uh, we were looking at in James uh, chapter 3, chapter 2, verses 14 through 26. If anyone has material possessions, sees his brother in need, and has no pity on him, how can the love of God be in him? Dear children, let us not love with words or tongue, but with actions and in truth. This, then, is how we know that we belong to the truth and how we set our hearts at rest in his presence whenever our hearts condemn us, for God is greater than our hearts and he knows everything. Uh, the thought of this uh, section here, 1 John chapter 3, verses 16 through 20, is that love is defined by Jesus. Right? It's not something we define, something that was defined by God and evidenced and exhibited in the life of Jesus Christ. This is how we know what love is. Jesus Christ laid down his life for us, and we ought to lay down our lives for our brothers. Not just for anyone, but for our brothers, especially for our brothers and sisters in Christ. If anyone has material possessions, sees his brother in need, but has no pity on him, how can the love of God be in him? Dear children, let us not love with words or tongue, but with actions and in truth. Live your faith, breathe your faith, work your faith. This then is how we know that we belong to the truth and how we set our hearts at rest in his presence. Whenever our hearts condemn us, for God is greater in our hearts. He knows everything. Uh, serving Christ in the name of Christ, the work of the Holy Spirit in our lives through the power of Christ. This should give us encouragement comfort and confidence to come before God's presence night or day, whatever our needs, because he hears us. We belong to him. We are his sons and daughters, sons and daughters of the king. Think about these things. This is what love is. Jesus Christ laid down his life for us. Go and do likewise. Be encouraged.